What's up, everybody? Today we're gonna do a bundle pack, Modern Horizons 3. Uh, we're gonna crack into it, see what we can do. So, with all that, I'm just gonna try to make this as quick as a video as possible. So that way we can get into the goods right away. Um, I haven't done any of this. I do have a play booster of this and the pre release of it. I have not done any of them yet. So, this one's the first, because I like to start with the bundles first. Don't know why, I just do. And we got the cool. Oh, that's weird. Nice. Kind of greenish looking. 15. There we go. Maybe that's going to give us some luck. Alright, let's just get into it. There's some goodies. Oh, you kind of crushed that one. And then we've got these. There we go. Inserts, all that fun stuff. Box is cool looking, I gotta say. Gotta say that the box is pretty cool. So, anyways, we're gonna put that off to the side. Over there. Alright, perfect. Let's just crack into them. That is our lands. I guess we can... We'll go through them quick. Alright, we'll just rip through these. Show you the full art with the little spaghetti monsters in them. There you go, there's the plains. There's the island. There's the swamp with the or tornado spaghetti monster. And then there's the forest. So this set looks like it was mainly geared towards Eldrazi. Hence the Eldrazi precon and all that fun stuff, which I did buy all four of. Those are those are pretty fun. Not gonna not gonna lie. I get the precons just because. There's the power balance, that is the promo for the bundle pack in foil. And then, of course, we've got the exact same thing, just in foil. So, there we go. This is what we came for. And there is nine of them now. Because they're play boosters, not bundles. Or not the, not draft or set or anything like that, so, whatever. Either way, obviously we're going for the Eldrazi's, we're going for the concepts, we're going for all that fun stuff. But, at the same time, there's also some pretty cool stuff in here. So there's Glimpse, Unfathomable Truths, Okay, Drosloth, Thren, Obstinate Gargoyle, Bespoken Battle Wagon. Oh, there's a cool little Trickster Elk on Fire. Lethal Throwdown. Blood-soaked insight and deep analysis. Oh, I see what we got. Oh, we got an Egan's binding straight off. There we go. That's nice. And I saw what we got: a jet medallion in the foil. Holy crap! That's a that's the way to start it off. And an island and a Phyrexian germ and energy combo. Interesting. I'm not used to getting dual dual-sided tokens. Nice. Jet Medallion and Ugin's Binding. Both together. One pack. Oh, we got an art card this time. That's right. They don't come with the art cards all. Corrupted Shapeshifter. So we did get a Odrazi Shapeshifter. Expanding Ooze. Petrid, Hex Gold Slith. Fanged Flames. We are going for some of the, the new lands as well. Well, they're not new, but you know what I'm talking about. Story Secret. Oh, is that one that flip? No. That's one that flips. Pinnacle Monk. What does that flip into? Mystic Peak. Nice. There's the Priest of Titania. It's always a good one. Or a decent one. Arenas of Glory. Rare Land. Not the one I was looking at. And Fanged Flames for the foil. And then we've got... Okay. The Whale that's a cloud. Dreamtide Whale. Yeah, that's the dream. Live in the dream. Alright. Well. I don't know what the arena is going for. I don't think it's going for anything that's worth anything, but hey, we got it. We're good. Let's see. Fang Flame. Oh, we got the Shapeshifter again. Refurbished Familiar. Here, I'll get it a little bit closer. Rose Cut, Warped Tusker, Bountiful Landscape. Arcbound Condor, Null Elemental Blast. That's kind of a cool looking frame. I'm not gonna lie, I like the purple and everything. And it kind of comes out, if you can see. 
kind of a f- comes out of the board. Anyways, signature slam and Hiroshi. All right, it's the Bart Commander, Angel of Ruins, and oh, there we go. We did get one of them. We got the Emrakul, the World of New. Nice, and the Sneaky Snacker in foil. Along with it, I'll draw C spawned. Nice, we pulled the Emrakul. So far, bundle is looking up. So is it worth it? Hmm? So far, it seems like it. This set is priced a little bit high. And by I say a little bit, I mean a lot of it. Uh, but you know what? It seems like the value and usability of the cards is actually there. That is a sick looking art. Horrific assault. See, that's that's the kind of art that I miss. Not the AI generated and everything. There's the insight. Expel the unworthy, even though it's not technically AI, but you know what I'm talking about. Tranquil Landscape, Sneaky Snacker again, Muster the Departed, Breaker of Creation. No, no sneaky. Urza's Cave. Okay, that's not what we were looking for. Annoyed Altasaur, also in, I believe, Lost Caverns. White of the Reliquary. Alright, Zombie Knight. Interesting. And the Ghost Fire Slice in foil. Kind of cool looking. And a Planes. Best card right there. Boom. This whole set's worth it. We got a basic Planes. Boom. That's bundle 100% worth it. Go buy it. If you're lucky enough to get a Planes. It'd be awesome. Oh, we got another. Guts to another art card. All right. Okie doke. Can't be the Jealous Thief. Party Auxiliary. Molten. Tune. Basking. Let's go. Hungry Lizard, Bountiful Landscape, Conduit Goblin. That's kind of a cool looking. Kozilex Unsealing, Laring Flesh Raker. Oh, this one flips. Razorgrass 2, Razorgrass Field. I do like those lands. There's the Kappa Cannoneer. Not, I don't think it held its value very well. Oh, but we did pull a Polluted Delta. Ugh, polluted Delta. That is what we're looking for right there. That is nice. And Grave Dig. Okay. So I saw these. And hold on. That is a Sphinx of the Revelation. Just so you know. So I saw these. And I looked at it. And it is just the back view of a different card. This is the exact same guy. I want to say... I think it's Gravedigger. If I can remember correctly. I have the card. I'll have to pull it out. And I'm going to look because it's just the back end of him. It's kind of crazy. And there's a Shapeshifter one that is the same, same art. It's nuts. I saw that. I was like, wait, that card looks familiar. It's because it's already a card. But they just retuned it a little bit. Anyways, we got Energy because Energy is back. Our auxiliary, Morton Gatekeeper, tune the narrative again, Basket, oh, the Hungry Lizards again, Wither and Bloom, there's the Richard Kane, he was doing a whole kickstart, he had a whole thing on that, Cranial Ram, was awesome, until it got banned, Seething Landscape, Quest for the Necropolis, Lift Elemental, Wampus, yeah, that is a crazy looking, crazy beast, Furnace Hellkite, alright, Distinguished Conjurer and Flare of Fortitude. Okay, and Flare of Malice. Not the flares that we're looking for, but I'll take them. Uh, Creepy Whale. Okay. Cool. Got the Creepy Whale. Alright, we are really doing some weird stuff here, so let's do this. Rare, rare. That one's mythic. Now we can kind of keep track. Rare, 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 mythic. So we got three mythics so far. Not too bad. And we got a pain land. And we got the Emrakul. And a foil jet medallion. I pulled a jet medallion out of the uh, Commander Masters. Ah, oh, I love this art. This is like one of, my, one of my favorite cards already. I don't even care if the card's good. I just think it is the... It's almost like it belongs in an unset. Just... Thwack the turkey's face, make his eyes bulge out. Awesome. 
Sentry, wing it, just wing it. Colonel Captor, Dogs, Riddlegate Gargoyle, Worm Coil Larva. That's how the engine starts. Titan right, Wave Breaker, Path of Annihilation? I don't think I've ever seen. Interesting. Okay. That's cool. Waterlogged Teachings into Inundated Archive. I do like those. We got a worn power stone. Okay. And power balance. Kind of reminds me of like a elemental blast, honestly. And the Ari Auxiliary and the foil. Along with a basic forest, the tunnel forest. Nice. You didn't even get a token on that. Damn. Alright, two more packs. Can we get a Nulamog? Wouldn't that just be sick? Holy crap. Just pull off an Emrakul and an Ulamog. Wow. That would be... Go buy the bundles. This is Siege Smash. Aether Spike. Expanding Ooze. Is Expanding Ooze a good one to put into a... Slime Against Humanity deck? A little slime deck? Probably. I'll have to look. The Trade Gargantua. Hex Gold Smith. Contaminated Landscape. Tranquil Landscape. We're getting all landscapes. Gold Tail Trainer. Is that Gold Tail? He came Golden Tail came from the Kamigawa. Collective Resistance. Root right back there. Sink into the stupor. Into the Sorfix Springs. I saw what we got. An Urza's Incubator. Nice. That's a decent pull right there. And Guide of Souls. There we go. And Rithing Chrysalis. A Drazi Drone. Okay. Oh. Got a double, double card. That's cool. Urza's Incubator is a decent. I don't know if it's worth anything, but I can tell you right now, it's definitely playable. And that's realistically what's more important. Nick's Born Hydra, because you know, these. some of them take it. Breathe Your Last, Inspired Inventor, Simulacrum. Oh, that's the Sarpedian Simulacrum, not to be mixed up with the Sad Robot. Tempest Harvester, Colossal Dread Mask, a Sneaky Snacker again for the third time, Pyretic Rebirth, Solar Transformer, Legion Leadership. What does this one turn into? Legion Stronghold. Okay. There's the Annoying Altasaur. And we are the right rip. Damn. Envoy of the Ancestors in the foil, and we got a foil full art. Land. That's cool. And, oh, that's an Archaea for sure. Right? No. That is almost identical, you would think. Ah, eh, maybe not. Alright. Anyways, there you go. That is the bundle pack. If you like it, do the normal thing. Like, subscribe, comment. It's free. Helps me. Put more videos out. I'm not getting paid from it, but that way it shows that everybody's enjoying it, and that way we can keep doing it. So that way I can waste my money and you don't have to. How about that? Uh, so with all that, I'll see you in the next time.